Hello, hello, welcome everyone. I have a flip through I would like to share with you. This is a new book I found at Walmart. This is Romanticy, a coloring book. This is actually a Dover Publications book. So the same one that does like some Jessica Mazurkiewicz and Marty Nobles and Teresa Goodrich. Um, so the paper is similar feeling to those books if you are familiar. Um, so this has a collection of artists. So Anna Badal, Hannah, Paul, I'm not going to butcher all their names. Um, but if we flip to the back here, it tells you a little bit about, about each one. So illustrator and world traveler, um, graphic designer and illustrator in intricate botanical artworks, digital and traditional portrait artist. Um, so it tells you all about kind of how they create their art. Now I bring this up because as we flip through the book, there are a couple pages where I was like, hmm, almost looks a little bit AI-ish, but I think because a lot of these are digital, that is why they look that way. So I don't think they're actually AI, um, but I'll kind of show you what I mean as we go through. So as you can see, it is a thick book. Here's the back. Over 60 illustrations, six female artists with a flair for fantasy invite you to a world where lovers become enemies, enemies become lovers, and readers become hooked. So let's take a look. And it does have the nice side where when it's on your bookshelf, you can kind of see what it is. So we will get started here. Let me get centered. So copyright 2024, Dover Parbury. Publications, art by Eva Nikunin, copyright, all rights reserved, all that good stuff manufactured in the good old U.S. of A. And then it tells you what romanticy is. And then we get started. So unlike the other Dover books, this is not a perforated book. So you could cut the pages out if you wanted to run an X-Acto knife down the edge. Um, but other than that, they do not pull out themselves. So on the back of each one is who the artist is. So this one is a Hannah Kay. We have Faye. So this one we have a little bit of grayscale built in, which is neat. I like that added addition. This is one I was a little confused on at first just because the way the hand is holding the bow, they look chopped off. And it might be the little guard she has on her fingers right here. Um, but that one came off weird to me at first. But again, I think it's because some of them do digital, so... And I do think hers are the guards she has on her knuckles. But at first glance, I was like, whoa, her fingers look chopped off there. Slow Bird Book Club. So now we are on to Anna's pages. Oh, I guess they switch back and forth because this is Hannah. Oh, that one was Hannah. Not super intricate. And then we kind of switch here. And so this is the other one that had me a little like, mm, uh, because of her hand. So it is well done. There's not like a lot of random things. It's not, you know, overly detailed. We can't color it or anything. Just that little. And it could just be hands are hard. Again, um, just trying to keep an eye out. I know it's everywhere these days. I like the little feet on this chair. a pretty one with the flowers and the little cups and crowns. Hmm. 
It's a little more violent than I usually tackle, but there's that dragon with his knight. This puff of smoke coming out was cool how they did it. So I did look this one up. This one is available on Amazon. Um, for $16.99. I did not pay that at Walmart. Mine was like 12 something, but I do believe the price has come down a little bit once the new wears off. This is a neat one. This would be cool to do in like some kind of metal, like a pretty gold or really silver scissors. I do like the paper. It's not like super thin. You can't see the images behind it, but it's, it's not cardstock for sure. So here's another neat one. A snake is eating himself, making a circle there. mirror. It'd be cool to draw something in the reflection of the mirror, kind of, so it wasn't blank. Pretty one for wedding season. couple pages in here. It's another sword. Noticing lots of the same kind of background with the little sparkle effect. Again, sparkle effect. Love and fierce. Pretty one with all the butterflies. This one must be Jenna too. Yep, noticing she has the dark, deep, thick black line line work. Sword with the same flowers, with the sparkly backgrounds. So there are a few of those in there. I would have to finish her eyeballs, but I do want to give the lightning on this one a try for some practice. Probably make a copy of it first. Um, never actually tackled lightning, so this one has my eye. have my eye on this one too, doing that snake, deciding on whether I want to metallic paint him or not. <laughs> so again, the sword and the sparkle effect. Um, the sparkle effect would be fun on a few pages, but if you got bored, they'd be real easy to cover with, you know, whatever background you're choosing, paint over them, color over them, what have you. Because they are on just about every page.
So if you wanted to, you could color this one and this one and hang them side by side and you'd have enemies to lovers and lovers to enemies. If you're into that kind of thing. It's a neat one. Wouldn't mind tackling that one. This is the Paul or Polly. I'm not sure how to say her name, but I do notice she has like the more thinner, intricate line work, which I adore. So there is a nice mix in here. If you need an easy day, you have the thicker, darker line work. Cute little dragon there. Definitely have to practice drawing some faces on. Don't know that I love their missing faces, but. This one reminds me of the Beauty and the Beast. Another cute couple. She's in the library. Wait, it's not too dark. Apologize, my sunshine left. It was here when I started. This one looks like a nice little version of the Little Mermaid. Will stay with me for a few more minutes while I finish. <laughs> this would be a neat one to do. Another one I would like to tackle. Maybe this would be a good one for like a fire and ice or like that pretty purple and blue kind of thing. There's a nice male portrait for those of you that are into those. Don't love the like background swishes but everything else. One one to tackle. That's a pretty key with some butterfly dragon wings on it. Butterfly dragon wings. Dragon wings. Pretty dragon wings. <laughs> Dragonfly, I should say. In there. Bug. Another cute couple. She even has a little bit of freckles, which I 
a door because I have freckles. <laughs> I like how they lightened everything behind the little glow of the light there. Kind of help you with that. Look. Anti-heroes. And then again, there's your little bit about the artist, Palais. It gives you kind of which one is their style of artwork. Like page if you need for testing. And there is our Romanticy by Dover Publications. Uh, thank you for watching. Questions, comments, requests, anything like that, please let me know. I will link it to Amazon below if you are interested. But again, if you have a Walmart, it is about five or so cheaper, probably depending on where you are. Hope to see you next time. Bye.